A mystery has been unfolding in the shadows of science, one that challenges everything we thought we knew about reality. Particles, separated by unimaginable distances, seem to share an invisible connection. They respond to each other instantly, faster than the speed of light, a discovery that left even Einstein deeply unsettled. Einstein called this phenomenon spooky action at a distance, and for decades it remained a scientific enigma. But in 2022, everything changed. Scientists pushed the boundaries of understanding by proving quantum entanglement across an astonishing 33 kilometers. Two particles behaving as one, defying the laws of classical physics. How do they communicate? And more importantly, what does this reveal about the hidden nature of our universe? At the quantum level, reality isn't what it seems. Particles exist in a state of infinite possibility until observed, as though they're waiting for consciousness to decide their fate. When two particles become entangled, their states are locked together no matter how far apart they are. Measure one, and the other instantly reflects the change, like a secret, instantaneous handshake across space. This discovery isn't just about particles. It's about breaking the limits of what we believe to be possible. If particles can defy the speed of light, could it mean that the universe itself is far more connected than we realize? Could these same principles apply to us, to the way our minds and consciousness interact with the world? These findings aren't confined to theoretical physics. They challenge our understanding of reality itself. It's no longer a question of whether quantum entanglement exists. The real question is how deep this phenomenon goes. Does it affect the way we think, the way we connect, or even the way we exist? This is just the beginning. In the coming moments, we'll uncover how this quantum strangeness might be playing out in the most unexpected place. Inside your brain, where 86 billion neurons may be the stage for a quantum drama that could redefine our understanding of consciousness. Deep within your brain, an extraordinary performance is unfolding. A performance so intricate and vast that it rivals the complexity of the universe itself. With over 86 billion neurons firing in harmony, creating more connections than there are stars in the Milky Way, your brain is not just a biological machine. It's a cosmic symphony, and recent theories suggest it might even operate on a quantum level. One of the most groundbreaking ideas comes from the penrose hameroff theory, which proposes that quantum processes might be happening inside your brain's neurons. At the heart of this theory are microtubules, tiny structures within brain cells that were once considered little more than scaffolding. But Penrose and Hameroff argue that these microtubules could be the stage for quantum coherence, where particles operate in perfect synchronization, enabling processes far beyond what classical physics can explain. Why does this matter? Because classical neuroscience struggles to fully explain the phenomenon of consciousness. How do billions of individual neurons create a unified experience of self-awareness? How do thoughts, emotions, and memories arise from a sea of electrical impulses? These questions have led many neuroscientists to turn to quantum physics for answers. Consider this. At the quantum level, particles don't exist in fixed states. Instead, they inhabit a field of probabilities, collapsing into reality only when observed. Could the same principle apply to the way your mind processes information? Could consciousness itself be a result of quantum effects happening inside your brain? If this is true, it would fundamentally change how we understand the mind. It could mean that your thoughts and awareness are not confined to the physical structures of your brain, but are deeply connected to the quantum fabric of the universe. It's a radical idea, but the evidence is mounting. For example, studies have shown that certain processes like photosynthesis and even the way we detect smells rely on quantum tunneling, a phenomenon where particles pass through barriers they shouldn't be able to cross. If quantum mechanics can explain these biological processes, why not consciousness? What's even more fascinating is how this perspective could reshape our understanding of reality. If the brain operates on a quantum level, it might mean that the boundaries between individual minds aren't as rigid as we think. Could this explain phenomena like intuition or moments of profound connection with others? Are our thoughts somehow resonating with the quantum web that connects all things? 
The answers to these questions are still emerging, but one thing is clear. The brain is not just a biological organ. It might be a quantum theater, where the mysteries of the universe are played out in the realm of thought, awareness, and consciousness. Next, we'll step beyond the brain and explore how these quantum mysteries manifest in the natural world, from the mind-bending double-slit experiment to the revolutionary findings in photosynthesis and beyond. For centuries, classical physics painted a predictable picture of the universe. Solid objects moving through space, bound by laws we could measure and trust. But the deeper scientists looked, the more cracks appeared in that tidy framework. At the quantum level, reality behaves in ways that defy logic, opening doors to possibilities that challenge everything we thought we knew. One of the most famous experiments in quantum physics is the double-slit experiment. Here's how it works. When particles like electrons are fired at a barrier with two slits, they behave like tiny bullets when observed, passing through one slit or the other. But when no one is watching, they act like waves, creating an interference pattern as though they pass through both slits simultaneously. Observation itself changes their behavior. It's as if reality knows when it's being watched and adjusts accordingly. But quantum effects aren't confined to labs and experiments. They're all around us, woven into the processes of life itself. Take photosynthesis, for example. Plants use quantum tunneling, a phenomenon where particles pass through seemingly impenetrable barriers to move energy through their cells with almost perfect efficiency. Without this quantum shortcut, life as we know it wouldn't exist. Even human senses may operate on a quantum level. In your nose, for instance, receptors detect smells through a process that involves quantum vibrations. Molecules seem to tunnel their way into fitting specific receptors, allowing us to distinguish an infinite variety of scents. These quantum processes are subtle but vital, hinting that nature has long been harnessing the power of the quantum realm. And then there's the revolutionary work being done in space. In recent years, Chinese scientists conducted groundbreaking experiments with entangled photons using satellites. By transmitting entangled particles between Earth and space, they demonstrated that quantum communication is not only possible but could revolutionize the way we think about technology. Imagine a world where information travels faster than light, immune to interception or distortion. What does all of this mean for us? It's becoming increasingly clear that quantum mechanics isn't just a set of strange rules for particles. It's a blueprint for the universe itself. And if reality at its most fundamental level is interconnected and dynamic, could it be that we, as conscious beings, are also entangled in this grand design? These discoveries blur the line between the physical and the metaphysical, suggesting that the quantum world doesn't just shape the particles around us. It may also shape us. Next, we'll take this idea even further by exploring the evidence for quantum connections between minds, revealing how consciousness itself might operate on a universal scale. Throughout history, Countless stories have hinted at an unspoken connection between minds, intuition, shared dreams, even the eerie feeling of knowing someone else's thoughts. While skeptics might dismiss these as coincidences, emerging science is beginning to tell a different story. Could our minds be quantum connected, tapping into an invisible network that links us all? Consider the studies on twin telepathy. Researchers at the University of Virginia have documented fascinating cases where identical twins, separated by vast distances, experience the same emotions or know exactly when the other is in distress. These instances defy logical explanation, but they may find a foundation in quantum mechanics. If particles can remain entangled over long distances, is it so far-fetched to wonder if human consciousness, which may operate on a quantum level, could do the same? Another intriguing body of research comes from the Global Consciousness Project. For decades, scientists have been measuring random number generators placed around the world, devices designed to produce completely unpredictable sequences. Yet, during major global events, moments of collective focus and emotion, these devices show patterns that shouldn't exist. It's as if human consciousness, acting in unison, can subtly influence the physical world. 
Even more groundbreaking are studies into distant mental influence on quantum systems. In controlled experiments, participants have been asked to focus their minds on influencing the behavior of particles or random systems. Astonishingly, the results suggest that focused intention, pure thought, can produce measurable changes. These findings challenge everything we know about the mind's limits, hinting that it may operate on a level far beyond the physical. Could this mean that our thoughts don't just stay within us but extend outward, interacting with the quantum fabric of reality? And if so, what does this say about the nature of connection? Perhaps our relationships, our empathy, and even our sense of shared humanity are rooted in a deeper quantum truth. This isn't just theoretical speculation. Researchers are already exploring practical implications, from developing technologies that harness this quantum mind connection to rethinking how we approach health, relationships, and communication. If our consciousness is truly linked on a quantum level, it could revolutionize how we see ourselves, not as isolated beings but as part of a vast, interconnected whole. The evidence is building, and it's only the beginning. In the next chapter of this journey, we'll explore how these discoveries are laying the foundation for a new science, one that bridges biology and physics, mind and matter, and shows us the limitless potential of quantum consciousness. We stand on the edge of a revolution, one that could redefine the way we view consciousness, life, and our place in the universe. Quantum biology, an emerging field at the intersection of physics and biology, is bridging the gap between the smallest particles and the grandest mysteries of existence. It's here that the true potential of quantum mechanics begins to reveal itself. Imagine the possibilities. If quantum processes are at work in your brain, in the way plants harvest energy, and even in the connections between minds, what could this mean for the future of humanity? The implications are staggering. In medicine, Understanding quantum biology could lead to breakthroughs we can hardly imagine. Cures for diseases, new ways to regenerate cells, and treatments that work with the body's quantum processes instead of against them. In technology, harnessing quantum entanglement could lead to unhackable communication systems and computational power beyond anything we've seen. But perhaps the most profound impact will be on how we understand ourselves. If consciousness is not confined to the physical brain but extends into the quantum realm, then our very existence is part of a grander design. It means our thoughts, our connections, and even our dreams may ripple out into the universe, shaping reality in ways we're only beginning to comprehend. The next steps in this journey will require open minds and bold thinking. As scientists push the boundaries of what's possible, they are not just exploring the nature of particles, but also the nature of life itself. What will we discover about the connections that bind us all together? And now, the question turns to you. Could your thoughts, your consciousness, and your actions be part of this vast quantum web? What role do you play in the unfolding mystery of the universe? This is more than science. It's a call to explore the depths of your own awareness, to see the connections you may not have noticed before, and to embrace the idea that you are more connected to the world and to others than you ever imagined. If this exploration has sparked a new curiosity within you, don't let it end here. Dive deeper into the mysteries of consciousness and quantum reality. Share your thoughts, challenge your assumptions, and be part of the conversation shaping the future of human understanding. Your journey into the hidden science of consciousness is just beginning.